It's truly amazing to see how a classroom should function. Till break? Yeah, we'll go till break. Set timer for 15 minutes. Are these all high achievers? I love that your class actually read and used the assessment tool that you've given them. I also love the collaboration. They had clear rules to follow and a timer to keep them on task. My, my holy grail has always been like, to be able to have technology that I could utilize and count on, but that I didn't have to, I didn't have to interface with, like I could walk around. Like, I mean, I talk with my hands, you know, it's like I, I do all these things and I try to move around with kids and I try to engage and I didn't want to be like stuck at a desktop or stuck here or stuck there. Draw what you see happening, start labeling things, draw your observations. I'm not going to give you the answer, but I like the questions. Classroom management is, it's difficult at, at the best of times. And I've never considered myself to be a really strong classroom manager. And so if you're starting to implement lots of collaborative work, your classroom management needs to be on point because you're asking the students to do a lot and it's very easy for them to get off task. What I want you to do is I want you to share with your partner at your table. So that management piece is sort of embedded in everything I do with Merlin. So the, the timers, the progressing through slides, the switching from one HDMI input to another. Switch to tab one. Things that I would be running back to a computer to touch it for that I'm not having to do. In my classroom, I don't have Merlin, and I do run back and forth to the computer. And during that time, you know, then they, they've lost a little bit of their focus. So. It's here to help us do this thing that we can do on our own, but we can now do it a lot more efficiently, and we can do it in a more straightforward manner because we, don't, we can offload these tasks onto this piece of technology. That's what I really like about it. Switch to HDMI 1. Once I figured out that, oh, this is not trying to be in the front of everything, it's just trying to be in the background, that's when I realized, like, oh, there's a lot to this.